game between Pop Talk and NSDSN. Flipped. Wonderful. Uh oh. Wait. No, don't yeah. worry about it. Don't worry about it. Yep, there we go. Alright, we're all set up now, so let's get going now into the game. Intrigued to see how Poptar does in his matchup. That was a very strong character. Good use of a counter there. Poptar probably for the most part anticipate Bowser players doing that by the ledge, but Ooh. when someone's recovering high. S Smash actually nearly killing from mid stage and on Bowser, like one of the heaviest weights as well. Yeah. Ooh. Goes for the up smash, but yeah. nearly misses. Just just mistimed it. There is actually less in interchangeable frames I heard in this game for normal getup. Ooh, and that down smash gonna be taking Yeah, uh, gonna use down smash. He was dash dancing all over the place. There's some of Joker's gun edge guarding, but not yeah, slight little get, but it's not really gonna help him in the long run. Unfortunately, characters with better recovery have a lot easier time dealing with it, but yeah, goes for the rebels guard off stage. He does yeah. nearly have his beater off of that. Oh, back air not quite killing Bowser yeah. being again bit yeah. mega heavy. Well, the SNS has unfortunately SD'd. Yeah, it didn't really need to air dodge an Aga. No, certainly not. That thing doesn't ever kill. Aegon needs like 180 to kill. And all right then, Arsene is now in action. Arsen just hitting Arsene, really, really sorry. hard. Oh, yeah, goes for the gun gift oh, again. No! And wow! air dodges. Uh, wow! I can only Would assume that was that? buffered, or maybe he thought he could make it back to stage with that. Well, either way, it just made NS panic, and hey, hey, it's in Poptal's favor now. Good job of dis deterring NS's approach there. Yeah, I think maybe Poptal should stand back a little, I think. Just because of how aggressive NS is playing with Bowser. Which is, which is why he's doing so well with him in the first place. Look at the pulling Kim's attempts. Oh, I'm loving it. Oh, and gets the persona off of that front up tilt. He certainly does. Our sense out to play and Good up smash. Patience. Not quite killing yet. No, not yet. Oh, Pop Dot is now starting to call out NS's unsafe approach options. Down tilt gonna be putting him out and he countered. Run off Simple counter. as that. That is something you can do against characters with a hitbox on their recovery. Yeah, or if they don't snap on the ledge. Or if they don't snap on the ledge as well. I don't know if it's going to be effective for characters like Chrom and Cloud when they have to recover high and don't snap the ledge, even though they, with their hitbox still being active. One thing that I think Joker players have noted is that both the versions of uh, Joker's counters actually have significantly less end lag on them compared to regular counters. So ah. that's like, you get a bit less punished if you uh, know what you're doing and still miss ah, it. Ah, that's interesting. Interesting to note. And then obviously everyone knows now you can just hold down Rebel's Guard for an extra few seconds if someone's not expecting you to and like makes you eat enough smash, just instant Arsene right there. Yeah, fair enough. And it's off to a strong start. Decided to go back to um, FD because um, Joker's up B can go through platforms and snatch out anyone trying to recover high to keep a strict combo going. So by taking away that option, should should help NS in this matchup. All right, but can we talk about that combo he just got on NS earlier? Really clean up air, or yeah, no, down air into grab, into up throw, up air, and then grapple right after. Yeah. But it's still a fairly even game though. Oh, Arsene's out to play, but unfortunately it causes him to overshoot the ledge as yeah. well. Arsene comes out right now. Air dodges back, but can't avoid the fire breath. Still yeah. has half of his meter left though. It does decrease by 1% yeah. per 1%. And NS is doing a lot of short jumps because he's trying to bait Popton to try to land on him so that he can then throw out oh. an up smash. I think that actually caught NS's jump, but... Ooh, oh, lovely! B. Unanticipated Bowser Ball. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, up throw itself, you can't grapple them out of it because they're still in hit stun. Grapple doesn't hit unless they're out of it. Oh, I see. But up air does allow you to grapple them right after if you fast fall with enough time, the precise timing. Yeah, I see. Uh, and there seems to be starting to get at the edge now. I feel like Pop Dark can't really get as get some some kind of com good length combo going. Well, because of the limitations percent. of. Um, you know, ways of he can add a lot of pressure to Bowser. 
run off there, not gonna kill, but he's that sort of, down he's sort of, will. He's sort of relying on... Yeah, I think he has to rely on Asun. Asun. I hope I said that right. Arsen. Arsen. What? Arsen. Arsen. I think he has to heavily rely on him to rack up a lot of damage when it comes out. Well, and also... And also... I'm trying to think approach-wise what's safe for Joker for this. Just missed the side B. Yeah, he's still trying to go for the grapple off of the up throw, unfortunately. Oh, gets the counter, but it is pretty weak. Akin to uh, Incinerator's Revenge. Up tilt gonna catch Pop Tart, nearly killing actually, good DI. And yeah. the Bowser, or the side B is gonna do it. Yep. Joker being, I think, as light as Body the Body slams him away. Well, Pop Tart can still make it back. But is he gonna get a chance? That's the question. If, if Pop Tart does lose this game, he would at least get the stage choice. No! Oh. oh, that was so risky. Back airs him right out of that up smash. Yeah. Back air, Joker's back air technically kills, but at fairly high percent though, around 140, depending on the character. It's better used as an offstage gimping, or like edge guarding tool, I yeah, think. Yeah, definitely. In general, his raw kill power. Oh, gets the shield break and falls right to his death. Yep. On guard. So we got a game for scenario, but again, Pop Tart has the advantage to choose what stage he wants to play on. It will certainly be a surprise if NS does manage to overcome Pop Tart. Yeah, people were talking about quite a bit. People were talking quite a bit about how uh, Joker does lack killing power without Arsene. While to an extent I disagree because of his good edge guarding tools and a well placed F Smash does kill at like. 70 or 80 at ledge on middleweights. Mm. Uh, with Bowser, it's extremely pronounced just because of his sheer weight. Yeah. I think Bowser's the third heaviest character in the game? Should be. We could just do a quick Googling. <laughs> I'm, I, I know it's King DDD. I know King DDD, DK, and Bowser. According to Kuragane Hammer, he's actually the heaviest oh, in the King game. Oh, King K. Rule is the second heaviest. Yeah. And DK and King DDD is actually tied. Yeah. Alright, let's get back to the match. Both players running back the same characters. Yep. Oh. Yep. So, decided Pokemon Stadium, pretty much the new Smashville from... The new Smashville from, like, Smash 4, because it's highly, highly used now in tournaments. Oh, up tilt into oh my goodness smash, me! Racking up 100% 15 wow. seconds in. You oh, know, he's trying to get a fair! Would have killed actually. Definitely would have, but Joker's waiting. Why I'm not? surprised Ennis did not risk a back air, but probably Ooh. the end lag of it was probably not really good. Pop Tart is guarding. now responding well, just missed him. Is this smash full marvel over again? Well, only time will tell. That was 2v by the way. And a side B, just not Ooh. gonna kill! Brilliant DI from Plastic Pop Tart. But Arsene is gone now, and, and another he's side, side B, B right again. Egg. Platform is gonna get a kill either uh, way. Yeah. Oh, it's definitely there. NS could beat Plastic Pop Tart. It's there. Whether he can manage to get over his nerves and such to do the, to pull it off. Oh yeah, and Plastic Pop Tart just demonstrated the very nice wave dashing wave dash like mechanic that Joker has with his bullets. Yeah, he didn't do explicit gun dashing, but uh, yeah. uh, the movement is like basically a roll. Yeah, yeah, basically. That and it opens so much, so much um, move, mix up movement options for Joker overall. Oh, Wenger and punishes! Oh my but goodness! Still catching the get up. Pop Tart needs to find something quickly. He's being outrun essentially. Yeah, back are not gonna kill from mid stage. No, he's air. not dead. Two hundred and nine percent. Oh, he's finally Good dead. Good back air. Alpdot has not taken advantage of the stage platforms. In fact, NS has been doing that. But that's mainly because of how aggressive his Bowser is, which can do some serious damage if you're not anticipating some of some of his um, approach options. And now we got Wenger out to Ooh, play all there was over some again. some trades going on. Oh, Normal oh, get up, but oh. NS mistimes it. Uh, There's the forward aerial coming out, and now some uh, 
Yeah, yeah that fire bat's just deleting. Him. Completely deleting our side. If you there. get a forward smash him, I wonder. No, I just can't see Pop Tart um, managing to take his second stock. He's not even doing. He's even struggling to edge guard NS because he doesn't know with Joker what was safe. Yeah, and, and that is it, ladies aerial. and gents. NSDSN beats Plastic Pop Tart on winner's side by two games to one.